Hello, my name is Albert. In the fourth quarter of 2009, I had extensive dental work done on the bottom front portion of my mouth where major extractions were done. And uh, as a result of that, I began to feel uh, neck pain and shoulder pain uh, coming down the left side of my, uh, of my body. And uh, I was later diagnosed with cervical dystonia or torticollis. And uh, I began treatment for that first beginning with physical therapy whereby I did uh, one course on that for a week or two and then we repeated it later down the road. And uh, after that it was uh, Botox injections. I was referred to a neurologist where uh, they started me on Botox injection at a very low dosage and I think it was a hundred milligram and then I was graduated up to 200 and my last shot which was January the 7th of, of this year was a 400 uh, milligram or cc or whatever at that level of Botox injection. Never can I say did it ever have a significant effect on me in terms of uh, helping it or making it better. It would seem to maybe numb it and make me lose control of my neck to where the muscles were just, uh, I don't know, maybe numb, but it, it didn't stop the muscle from spaz spazzing. On uh, continuously researching on the internet for people who were involved in the service called dystonia or torticollis, I found uh, a name of a doctor that was giving new treatments. Uh, that doctor was uh, Gary Demergen out in California. So I called Dr. Demergen, left him uh, an extended uh, voicemail explaining my situation, asking for his help. And uh, believe it or not, the doctor had called me back in less than an hour's time. He personally called me back and he uh, said he was looking forward to uh, helping me. He said, but I need not fly out to California. I live in New Jersey. I need not fly out to California that he had a guy that could take care of me in the Baltimore area, a gentleman named Dr. Sims. So he uh, referred me to Dr. Sims where I first made my initial contact with Dr. Sims. And uh, the doctor invited us down, my wife and I came down and uh, uh, he'd done a three hour uh, evaluation uh, and review of everything I had. We looked at all the paperwork. He'd done an extensive uh, uh, evaluation of where the pain was and, and what it was and why it was. And uh, come to find out, he was able to diagnose me, diagnose me with uh, TMJ disorder, the uh, jawbone uh, joint butching or, or, or what have you that's located about right here. You can feel that your fingers are there and you open your mouth. Uh, as a result of the teeth missing in the back of my mouth, I had a very poor jaw alignment. And because my jaw was misaligned, it was uh, uh, inadvertently pressing against a nerve that was causing all the downstream effect of the pain down my arm, the neck pain, and all the things that I previously described as cervical dystonia or with a college. Uh, Dr. Sims has been uh, uh, really great with working with me to, uh, uh, to, to try and control it. And uh, it happened the strangest way if we were taking uh, wooden tongue depressors, the thickness of them, putting them in your teeth, and while that's in your teeth, it would hold your TMG joint at an open position, relieving the pressure on the nerve. It was really strange to me, but it really did work. It allowed your body to reset itself, and we would do some walking and different uh, uh, activities to uh, ensure that we were correctly diagnosing uh, uh, what the problem was. We had a dental appliance uh, made, uh, 
to, to, that would fit into my mouth and uh, take up the space that was uh, there as a result of the missing teeth. And that's where I am today, working with the dental appliance uh, to uh, retrain my jaw misalignment to uh, correct the TMJ. So just got it today. It's, uh, it's, it's new for me yet and uh, uh, we'll continue forward with, uh, with this treatment. Thank you. One more time. Okay, hang on a second. Okay, you can put that in for me. Okay. All right, you have your orthotic in now, right? Orthotic's in. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right, tap your teeth together. Make sure you got them in the spot. Okay, good, good. Okay. One more time. 